crescendo. And we're off here over the red line side. Bot spinning out, shooting 6,800 Valor. Shooting into that speaker for the red line. That's one, two shots up on the blue lines. We had one shot, but not a lot of movement right now. Let's see if Valor can get three. And that's going to be it for the autonomous period. Now as we move into Teleop, Red Alliance with the commanding lead already, 31-2-9. Let's see if they can maintain that as the match goes on. Valor's robot flatline continuing to cycle notes over to the other side of the field. Meanwhile, the Howdy Bot's low rider trying to score into that amp to maybe bring out the, attentional, the potential amplification of the scoring. Shots going into that speaker continuously from 6,800 Valor. Lady Can's Pinkachu trying to play a little bit of defense while they go to get some notes from their source. 6,800 picking up another note to shoot into that amplified speaker. That's two. Now they got three notes, and that's three. That one's, the last one's not going to be amplified, but still going to give you points. Howdy Bot's low rider looking to score in that amp. Meanwhile, the Blue Alliance, they have an amplified speaker. They're scoring in it. 1745 P51 Mustangs trying to get one shot off, but it's not there in time. Mustangs and Lady Cans both shooting and scoring in the blue speaker. As 6377 Howdy Bot looks to cycle back to the Red Alliance source. Valor shoots another one into the high speaker for the Red Alliance. Continuing to widen this gap between the two alliances. Eighty-seven, eight, sixty-nine. Gortz playing a little bit of interference with Adam, and another shot in for Pinkachu from the Lady Cans. And with that sound, we're in our last twenty seconds. Let's see what teams are going to try. Big slam there from Dred Zeppelin. As Flatline continues to score into that speaker. With three seconds left, human players now trying to spotlight their robots. And that's the match.